The astronauts are beginning their work outside the ISS. Their spacewalk will involve making repairs and installing new equipment. Piers Sellers has clocked up six spacewalks in total. And I can remember almost every minute of each of those. It's really burned on, on my memory. The very first time I, was, uh, I went on a spacewalk, I was actually the first guy out the hatch. So I opened the hatch, ducked out, and I found myself above this huge shining earth that was spinning by me, this big silver spaceship above me, and I was hanging on by a handrail. And for a horrible second, I felt that everything was upside down the wrong way around. Uh, I've got a complete vertigo for about 30 seconds. Couldn't figure out where I was or any, how anything was oriented. And I think it was just the overload of seeing all this bright material, you know, the, the, the earth, the bright white sun in a black sky, huge spacecraft over, above me, completely disoriented me. But after about 30 seconds, everything went whoosh, lined up and I never got it back. The astronauts will work for up to eight hours at a time outside. It's a strange and eerie world out there. The sounds in space, um, it's odd to have a hammer or a metal tool and bang it against something and hear absolutely nothing. You can, you know, sound won't travel in a vacuum, so there you are outside and you could be hitting something, no sound at all. On the other hand, if somebody comes up and starts hitting your spacesuit or bumps your helmet, you can hear it because it conducts through and uh, you can actually talk to each other if your radios have failed by putting your helmets together and you can talk person to person through your helmets, have a secret conversation. 